All right, so remember the school lunch hour? There was the popular table, the sports table, the other cliques. The girls uh, who wear pink on Wednesdays. I, I guess. I was not part of any of them. Uh, it makes it tough, though, when you don't have someone to sit with, right? That's until now. Schools across the country and in central Illinois want to make sure everyone has a seat at the lunch table. Ryan Burke, he discovered how one school carries out the mission. Well, I did. It's called No One Eats Alone, and really the concept is pretty simple. It's making sure that everyone is able to come together at lunchtime. Now, I recently visited Franklin Middle School in Champaign to see how they're bringing everyone together. It's lunchtime, and Langston Spann is gathered with his friends enjoying Taco Day at Franklin Middle School in Champaign. And while he has plenty of people to talk to come noon hour, he knows that's not the case for everyone. You're basically around all these big groups of people talking and laughing, having fun, but you're basically not engaged in any of them. And it might seem like they're kind of just like singling you out where they might not even notice you. It's a feeling Franklin Middle School doesn't want anyone to go through. The reason school counselor Kristen Monahan decided they should join hundreds of other schools around the country and participate in the No One Eats Alone Day. So we did a kind of get to know you bingo so they could um, go around to their people at their table or close by and they have little statements on there like um, I have a cat, I have three siblings, just to get them to interact with each other. Um, good way to start conversations with other kids. And then we had a photo booth, which was really fun, um, some Valentine props, and then, you know, just about no one eats alone. It's simple activities with an important goal, making sure everyone is included. Yeah, it definitely can be challenging for kids to feel like um, they don't have a group or a connection. Um, and I think that's what we are always striving for here at Franklin is to try to figure out where they can get connected, whether it's an after-school activity, whether it's doing something really quick at lunch like we did today for No One Eats Alone Day, just promoting and getting kids more aware that there are kids that struggle with that and that they should be reaching out to those that they're not normally reaching out to. No One Eats Alone Day is designed to do more than just help students who otherwise wouldn't have a place to sit for lunch. It's also to encourage all students to chat with people they maybe wouldn't normally sit with. Whenever I do get the chance, I will talk to somebody new, just especially if they're new to Franklin, because that's always a great way to show off how Franklin is and also make new friends with someone else. Bringing Franklin together one kind gesture at a time. I had one girl pull up a student um, from a different classroom, a functional life skills classroom, and say, come take a picture with me. It was awesome. No one eats alone day. Serving up kindness and respect. A menu choice everyone can agree on. Now, the official national No One Eats Alone Day was actually last Friday, but Franklin decided they wanted to move it to this week so that they could part, make it part of their Random Acts of Kindness Week, oh. which is a whole other thing. Oh, yeah. They've got all these cool activities planned, which they said that's going just as well. So a great week of inclusion over at Franklin. Love it. I like that idea a lot because I was one of those that I didn't fit into any particular group very well. Sure. Like, I, I, I moved amongst groups, mm -hmm. but I wasn't like, this wasn't like, these weren't my, you know, People. my tribe yeah. or whatever it was. So, like, having the opportunity to meet different people and feeling comfortable where you are makes a huge difference. Right, and even for the folks, you know, that have the place that they sit with their same friends every day, it's nice for them just to get a chance to talk to other people. Yeah. So, yeah. Cool stuff. Thanks, Ryan. Yeah. All right, we got to get to today.